Are we rolling? I never know what the hell's going on here. Hello! Yes! My name is David Bronstein. David Bronstein, the king of late night TV. If you flip your channels, you'll see me on late night television, a lot of these crazy dating shows. I am the producer. You hear my wife, she has the garbage disposal on. I'm trying to do a show here. My wife puts the garbage disposal on. I'm the producer of the hit reality show American Stripper, like American Idol, but for strippers. And it stars Ron Jeremy. My world is a three ring circus. I am like the guy in the Ed Sullivan show, spinning all these plates, hopefully one doesn't fall. What goes on in my world, you're going to want to tune in every day to the David Bronstein blog on YouTube. Because the stuff you're going to hear here in my world, you can't write this stuff. Then there's a writer strike. So all the writers, tune into this because you can't write this stuff. You're getting free material from me. My kids are hollering in the background. I'm trying to do a show here, for God's sakes, on YouTube. A million of people are going to be listening. And I got my kids hollering in the background and my wife with a garbage disposal. You see what I, you see what I goes on in my world? Anyway, this is epi oh, wait, Now it's with the dishes. Now the holler with the dishes. Anyway, um, now they're singing. Anyway, <laughs> this is my world. <laughs> Anyway, uh, tune in to the David Bronstein blog, David Bronstein World Every Day, and get me the hell out of here. That's all I'm saying. Now, uh, for those of you who don't know me, you can check me out at davidbronstein.com. davidbronstein.com. D-A-V-I-D-B-R-O-N-S-T-E-I-N. Bronstein. davidbronstein.com. And you can find out more funny videos on me and who I am and the shit that I do and the, the, why I am the king of late night TV because my shows are running 150 times a week except you, the two fans watching this, don't know who the hell I am. I'm a big star in my mind. But here's the here's what happened today in the David Bronstein world and what goes on in my show business world with all my show business friends and, and the new reality show. I got four shows under development. Um, the, the, how, uh, but American Stripper, tune in. You go to AmericanStripperTV.com. If you go to American Stripper TV, like television.com, you can see clips of the show and promos and all that stuff. But the reason I'm doing this blog is because I got to get it out of my head. My world is like Larry David on Curb Your Enthusiasm. That's scripted. Mine's real. And here's what happened today in my nutty world. I have a dog. His name is Sandy. He's a golden retriever. Now, Sandy is on more medication than my wife and my mother-in-law. Sandy is itchy. we got to give him itchy pills. Then he has a thyroid problem. There goes the dishes again. Then he has a thyroid problem. And then he has a, um, a, a antibiotics he has to take. He gets all red. So, hip dysplasia. Hip dysplasia. Hip dysplasia. Hip dysplasia. So, and, Andrea said, you have to go to the vet to pick up the pills today. So, I said, how much are the pills? So, my wife said, the pills are... Um, oh, here's, here's the dog. Look at this. I got, can, you see the, can you see the dog here? There's the dog. Well, look. look. Can you see, uh, see the whole house? Anyway, um, I had to get pills from the dog today. So the, the, the pills are these itchy pills called Venectal. Andrew says the Venectal pills are going to cost um, $12. But the antibiotic, that's $100. Uh, but I, I said, well, did you run out of pills? So I don't have any Venectal pills, the itchy pills. But I have the antibiotic till next week. I said, fine, I'm just going to pick up the itchy pills. So I went to the vet today to pick up the itch. I said, hello, I'm David Bronstein. They know who I am. And I walked in. They said, we got the pills here. It's 12.88. I said, oh, 12.88. Maybe they made a mistake. So they put two bottles of pills on the counter. And I look at the pills, and it says 12.88, but that's the number of the, the prescription or something like that. If I was hoping they make a mistake, they didn't make a mistake. I said, how much are these Venecto pills, the itchy pills? And they said, $19. I figured, all right, $19. And how much are these antibiotic? And they said, $107. So I said, well, I'm not going to take the antibiotic now. I'm just going to take the itchy pills for $19. I threw the whole veterinarian clinic off. They had to close the store. They couldn't figure out what the hell is going on. I have three people now trying to, well, wait a minute. We already calculated. We already figured it out. It's already in our system. We, we calculated the, the Venecto with the Novonexin, and, and it's already there. Couldn't you take the whole thing now? I said, I, said, I, don't, I don't need it all now. I got the, the antibiotic. Until next week, I have some. So I just need the itchy pills now. All right, we got to bring this one in. They got to bring the accountant in. They got to bring the software developer. They got to bring all these people in. Uh, the, the, the whole world, <laughs> it, it's YQ, Y2KO, whatever the hell all over. Because they already made up the invoice. Can't figure it out now. So now I got three people running, pushing, calculating, figure. All right, they said, you promise you'll get it next week? I said, yeah. I, I'm not going to take it now. I'm not going to pay for it now. I said, so what are you going to do? You Well, we already filled the bottle. We put the cotton in. We put the cap on the top. I said, but I don't want it now. I just want the, the itchy medicine. Just give me the itchy medicine, and I'll get out. I used to work in the Catskill Mountains, like Dirty Dancing. I was a comic in the Catskill Mountains, and there was a joke, a comic, that uh, used to say, give me the police, I'll get out. That's what it reminded me of. I said, just give me the itchy medicine, and I'll get out. That's all I want to do. So she, she's calculating stuff on there. She's okay. Just give me $25 for the Venecto. <laughs> so I said, 20? I said, well, how, how, how much is the Venecto? 
She said nineteen dollars. <laughs> so why am I giving twenty five dollars? Why is she asking me for twenty five dollars if the Vanetta's nineteen dollars? So now in this country, in Canada, I'm from Philadelphia, but in Toronto there's two taxes. And then they total up to 15% or 14% now. So I'm thinking, well, wow, $19, 14%, 10% is a dollar, 90, another 45 cents, 80, whatever the hell it is, 80 cents, 90. I thought it's maybe $22. I said, I said, well, I thought maybe she's asking for $25 for the Veneto, and she's going to deduct the rest from the other pills, and I pick them up next week. So I said, well, how much are the other pills? She said, when you come back to get the other pills, that'll be $108. How did the prices go up already? I'm standing right there. They went from 107 to 108, 19 to 25. How can they go up so fast? Gas goes up that fast. And, and, <laughs> gas and the gas line goes up. And here, my gas goes up. My kid's a lot of gas, too. But anyway, um, here's enough gas to drive to Pittsburgh. Anyway, uh, you'll hear a lot more jokes when you keep tuning in my blogs every day. But I, I said, but these pills are $19. How do they get to $25? She, I, I said, how much is taxes? 14%. I said, so how do you get $25? All right. Do I have to figure it out for you? Do I have to calculate it? I'd rather do business with your wife. I like when your wife picks up the pills. You think I, do you like this? You like it? I got a lot of respect. The, 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 the vet lady is telling me I, I messed up her whole system. She'd rather do business with my wife. I said, you could do business with my wife. Well, I'm, I'm, <laughs> see, I just had my nose fixed. Now my mouth doesn't work. I said, you could do business with my wife, but I'm paying for your pills. So if you want, you can get the pills to my wife, but I'm paying for them. I said, so get a calculator and calculate 14% on $19. She calculated, she's already has $22. I said, all right, I want to pay exactly what the taxes are. I don't want to pay anymore. Why do I have to go through this? Why can't it be so simple as, hello, I'm Mr. Bronstein. I'd like to buy these pills, these itchy pills. She said, oh, very good, they're $19, and that's it. Why do I have to go with three people? Well, we already calculated, we stuffed the pills, we stuffed the cotton. Can't take the whole thing, it'll be 108. I mean, why does this whole thing have to, I don't want to do with you, I want to deal with your wife. Why does this have to go on? And this happens every day with people that I deal with in my life. Every day. Now, i got more blogs to do, but uh, according to the system on YouTube, I get 10 minutes to talk. How long have I been talking already? Four minutes and 27 seconds. So this is going to be one blog now, and then I'm going to do the other blogs. I want to make them short. So tune in to the David Bronstein Hour, like Caesar's Hour. Tune in to, what's that? Oh, here. My wife gave me these, um, can you see this? Here, they're uh, blueberries. My wife gave me blueberries because they're supposed to be very healthy for you. I don't like blueberries, but they're delicious. Anyway, um, they're antioxidants. Delicious. Anyway, uh, did you wash these? I just washed them. I right, just washed them. Good? Delicious. Tune into the I don't know if they're sour. Tune into the David Bronstein blog, My Life Every Day. And to see more, go to DavidBronstein.com. I don't know how to put a crawl over here. I had another system called many cams. You put the crawl there. I could shut the whole thing down. Go to DavidBronstein.com. You want to get in touch with me? DavidBronstein.com. You want to appear on American Stripper? I got four other shows I'll tell you about. You get in touch with me, DavidBronstein.com. I go to American Stripper TV.com to see the American Stripper show. I'm David Bronstein, the king of late night TV, signing off. And remember to go to DavidBronstein.com and tell all your friends. DavidBronstein.com. I'm the guy from late night television, the producer of the hit reality show American Stripper and Zoom Dating, the dating guy, the guy in the nightclub that says, Go to the phone. What are you talking to me for? I produce infomercials. My company, DB Entertainment, produces infomercials, reality shows online content and we manage certain celebrities for online sites so get in touch with david bronstein at davidbronstein.com and tune in to the david bronstein blog world every day on youtube now how do, how do i figure this out here finish cancel i can't figure what the hell's going on there